Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 2 of Let's Play Secret Agent Barbie Royal Jewels Mission. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. That's a long ass title for a video game, I'll tell you that much right now. But we're going to Italy in the Opera House. Camille is meeting a scientist named Dr. Crony at the Opera tonight. We think he might have stolen the famous Prince's rubies. Why would he steal jewels? I don't know, to sell them on eBay? Don't judge, man. That's right. Ignore girl. He is not ignoring girl. Alright, well, I guess I'll just have to smoke them out. Play some Pong while that guy is just doing nothing. How does that security get a job, anyway? Just let me do my own thing. Oh, those payphones look so vintage. Why does there have to be so many of them? Oh, apparently I can drop gadgets while I'm in here, too. And not just the dog. I gotta take care of four balls. Four balls, Italia, I'm telling ya. Oof, nice. Here, you want another one? There you go. You know, just in case you're not dealing with enough asthma at it as is. So many people miss that file there. Like not noticing that there was a place for the dog. Oh, they have lady. Uh, they have lady guards now. Well, at least they're making some progress in uh, gender diversity. Now let me go get that later in case I screw up some more. I can just fill it up easier. So this is not exactly the best of uh, stealth games, given that there's not that much consequence for being caught. They don't even stun your movement or anything. You can keep moving at normal speed. Good boy, you do your thing. Yeah, let me four CDs now. Scout out the rest of the place. Okay, now you got me five CDs. Okay, so you can't actually pick up the, um, you know, like uh, the health bars or health pickups. I'm just gonna call them health pickups because technically that's what they do. And I broke my legs. She's chasing me the whole time! Holy crap! She did not stop! You see that? She just kept going like almost all the way. Then I had to choke her out with some gas. There. I throw it at your back. Oh, the, the females actually recover fast. So I have to be extra careful when I'm getting caught now. Yeah, the, the guys, they just give up. Dr. Crony says, I have the rubies. I'll meet you at the lab in Mexico to run some final tests on the jewel-making device. Oh, well, we're leaving Italy already? It's a short trip. Ooh, I get a water jet now. 
Nope, I'm still in Italy. So it looks like I guess it's four levels after each place. Dr. Crony is getting away! Barbie, use the high-tech water jet to follow him and collect the files he dropped. Sorry I had to uh, ruin the uh, gondola ride there. I suck to be in Venice right now. But I have to get CDs. Fortunately, they tend to be in the opposite lane of where I'm too. So once I collect those, I'll go after the dock. Fitting that his last name is Crony, because that's pretty much what he is. Yeah, you get away from me. You don't like the women. You, you're too shy. Scuba outfit? Okay, I thought I was a mermaid. Fashion district. Well, Italy is the place for fashion. We think Dr. Crony might be in the fashion district. Use the robot spy puppy to distract the guards so you can get across the town. I was gonna use the dog anyway. Thank you! <laughs> Apparently it was safe over here. Uh, oh, okay, not, not so much. Oh, okay. Can you go over that way, please? Thank you. Oh, there was another CD over here. over here. Can you crawl under, please? Oh, he's trying! Look at him! Look at him! He's gonna try! That's so hilarious! I don't know why. Why is my life so sad? Actually, it's not sad. Because I get to enjoy it with you guys. Likes the dog. I always go for random CDs under the table in Italy, but only in Italy. Random CDs in uh, Spain, ha, huh, not so much. It's mostly about independence and Catalonia and stuff. Those aren't fun CDs. I'm more into new metal. <laughs> okay. What else is there to get here? Good to know that lady guard was not near. That would have been a shite time. Why would you walk into that? You are the worst guard! Why do I feel like the design of some of the enemies was just like a, uh, a staunch go at feminism? Because the male guards, they give up right away. But the female guards, they'll pursue you to the end. It's amazing how aggressive they are compared to their male counterparts. What? That did not work? Oh, right. I still like gas going. I should have went down this ladder. Joke on it. Okay, can I get back to that safely? Nope! Seemed like a good idea at the time. Right. I still need one more file, and I got them all. 
hope they don't put any under, like, the foreground. Oh, there it is. That's much better. You like dogs, don't you? Okay, get over there before she sees you. Because they hunt you down. And with that, what do I get? Ooh, another outfit. Well, I did need a change of wardrobe. Scuba search. I get to go underwater. The entrance to Dr. Crony's lab is underwater. Put on your special scuba gear and find the entrance. Watch out for the security robots. Okay, apparently I don't have any gadgets to use underwater. So I can only go upward by hitting up. And of course, you know, the rest. I only need to use the uh, directional buttons and nothing else. It's very interesting that there's like entire structures underwater. So many flowers too. Like they're not drowned or anything. That's oh, that sucks. That's very interesting set up like that. Okay, so far I'm doing well in collecting all the CDs. Wait a minute, hold on. Why does my shadow appear over here? That looks so strange how the hitboxes work for shadow detection. Get to the CD going this way. I hope I am. Oh, that's a weird movement pattern. No. I have to go the other way. Alrighty then. I guess that's what I'll do. Why do I arch my back? It's like I've been hitting the yoga. Or maybe I just have very shite posture. One of the two. You know, it could be both. Maybe she's just really bad at yoga. That's why she's more into the spy business. Also, then I gotta go back, so I need to get that. I don't know how readable these uh, CDs are gonna be, seeing as how they've been underwater for so long. I mean, not to mention the fact that they don't have any mass whatsoever, considering they levitate. That's probably another issue right there. I'm just gonna throw that out to HQ that maybe we need CDs with mass. And I'm not talking about like a Catholic mass. That's been an HR issue over there altogether. You know, religious sensitivity and stuff. We want to make everybody in HQ feel the agnostics. Do they even have religion in the Barbie universe? I don't think they do. Barbie finds the missing jewels. There is one gem missing from each royal jewel. How strange. How would Camille want with just one gem from each jewel? Barbie, the jewels all contain a rare gem. Each gem is the only one of its kind in the world. If combined, they would create a hypnotizing light. Imagine if they fell into the wrong hands. How do you know this? I mean, they're worth money. So of course they would be coveted. What is this? Oh, are these like mini games? Oh, these are like the hack games. So I can just replay them. Okay, I still need one more scuba outfit. And 
or so, three more of these things. So I think I'm going to the last world. And I'm probably going to have like two more hacking games. Yeah, Mexico. Sunny City! There's never nighttime in Sunny City. Barbie! We need to stop Camille and Dr. Crony before they make the hypnotizing gems. Try and reach the other side of the city and find them. Couldn't you just land me in that part of the city where I can get to them? I feel like we're putting in more effort than we need to. I'm just saying. There's probably a better way. out a better plan so you know we can work smarter but not necessarily harder I'll bring it up at the next meeting okay and I've got to show off some of my new outfits that we made out of compact discs very thrifty and chic we still say chic over in the office do we just gonna stick with lit. What is this? Okay, I I've seen this before. The object, the objective is to clear out as much percent as possible. I want to say like Kakama Night or whatever it's called. Whoa, leave me alone. God, if those ladies get ya, consider yourself screwed. Thank you. I guess I figured out their weakness. They can't climb ladders. They can run. They just can't climb. Also, I think I gotta like try that again. Can't wait till this build up all the way before I go. There we go. That's that's better. I got three CDs. Hope I didn't miss any. God, th this music does not sound good at all. It doesn't sound like it fits. Not that I'm a connoisseur for what I should expect out of my Barbie music, but come on. Doesn't really give me that vibe of Mexico. Okay, I almost got all of the CDs. At least we're in a city where it's sunny all the time. It's always sunny in Mexico. Oh, wait a minute. I don't want to redo this level. So I'm going to look around for where that other CD is. Is it up here? Can't really tell where it is. Seem like it's immediately on the lower level. Where could I have missed it to? Please tell me it's not somewhere in the beginning of the level. It could very well be. Suck. 
Leave me alone! I like how they're oblivious to something that's j obviously jumping towards them. Well, I'm near the beginning. Oh! It was at the beginning of the level! Oh my gee. Could I have not picked a tighter outfit? Jeez. That ass, girl. Oh. Why'd I do that? I didn't even need to. Alright, well, let's finish it for real this time. Hey, maybe this Let's Play will only be two episodes. At the rate I'm going. Oh, this music just drones. And it looks like they only have, or sounds like, they have only one track per um, world. that one. Barbie overhears Camille. The device is inside the Aztec Pyramid. Soon we can hypnotize anyone. No one can stop us. Except one. Blind agent. <laughs> oh man. We get to go on a horse. I get to ride a, a horse inside a pyramid. Barbie, this Aztec pyramid has been updated with the latest security robots. Good luck. Oh, I wanted to ride the horse inside this. Okay, I can't say I'm a fan of this idea of, you know, computers inside a pyramid. I'm just saying, it doesn't seem like something that should be. This is nothing like the Pitfall games. Where instead of like uh, robots and, you know, computers, they'll just put in, you know, spikes. But I think Pitfall was like more for like the Mayan ruins rather than Aztec. I've only played some of the original Pitfall, and that was from the uh, SNES version of Pitfall, or rather, it was the PC version of Pitfall, but we were able to unlock the, um, well, me and a friend were able to unlock the PC version, or, or rather, the old school version, which is based on Atari, well, the Atari version of Pitfall. Okay, that's just for when I need to get back. Goodbye. I am invisible. Don't look for me. Wait a minute. Looks like I should be able to. Oh yeah, I gotta do it from this side. Is there more than one CD in that one spot? Okay, good. I don't have to backtrack in this stage. Okay, so this must be the hard mode version of this game. Oh wow, they're 
they're actually throwing the balls while you're still waiting on the other one. Disrespect to these ruins, I'm telling ya. Why must you disrespect tribes that just, like, uh, rip out people's hearts? High-tech hideaway. Oh, come on. When do I get to the level where I get to be the horse? Not, not the be the horse. Ride the horse. What is wrong with me? Barbie doesn't just become a horse. It's like, we only recruit the finest secret agents that are like Animorphs. That one would be pretty cool, though. To have secret agents that can turn into animals at will. Also, you gotta be able to, like, roll around a ball like Samus. That's part of your training, alright? think they would do that just put all four CDs in one spot well this may not even be a long level then at least I hope not wait a minute oh I still need to get to that door That's how I'll do it. So yeah, the thing about the Kakamonite games is when you're creating a line, you can't have your um, your orb touch that bouncing ball, and you can't have the line that you're currently creating touch the ball either. I'm sure there were other games of that same mechanic like it. Akamai Knight? I think that's the name of the title. It's the only one I can think of. Because that's one I've actually played. I'm not even touching the thing. Ooh, that was close. Oh, I need 85%. There you go! That's one way to skin a cat! that saying was ever around by someone that was actually skinning cats. I I'm just gonna throw that out there. Skits! <laughs> you have something in the vault? Ooh, I want this horse. That one looks cooler. Courtyard chase! Stop, Camille! Your evil plan is over! Barbie! Use one of the horses to chase Camille! Don't let her escape with the gems! Oh, but I wanted to walk! Why did I not get that? I didn't get a CD, so we're just gonna let her go. Do I have to, like, actually clear the hurdle to get, get credit for the CD? Okay, that was rather strange. It looks like the CDs are only over the hurdles. So whenever I see a hurdle, chances are the CD is right there. Oh, this music is very uninspiring. Okay, there was an exception there. I gotcha. Camille and Dr. Crony will both be going to jail for a long, long time. Thanks, Burt Reynolds. Barbie, thanks to you. All the royal jewel jewels have been returned. Great job! I am putting through a call to you. 
Thank you, Your Majesty. I am glad we could help. Yes, you're right. We do make a great team. Your password is t t t t t t t t t t t Super cover? What the hell is super cover? Uh, let's test it out. I'm guessing it just makes you invisible the whole time. Hmm, let me test it out on an actual guard. Oh, I guess it doesn't really do anything that special. Eh, not that it matters anyway. What matters is we were able to win. Oh, we have expert mode. Okay, so it's basically a harder version of the game. Kinda all it is. Maybe it just makes your meter go down faster, or you have a smaller meter. But anyway, that's it! That's a Secret Agent Barbie Royal Jewels mission. I keep rolling my eyes thinking I'm gonna mess up the title, because it's way too long. And the game itself is short. Like, if you didn't care about completion, you could probably beat it in less than an hour. So, not a long game at all. Would I recommend it? Eh, probably not, unless you're into this kind of stuff, which, you know, if you like a lot of purple and pink on your map, huh, be my guest. But anyway, this is the Bonga signing off saying goodbye, Godspeed, and stay tuned for my next Let's Play. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I shall see you next time.